Hello and welcome to WordPress Tutorials. In today's video, I'll show you how to import Amazon's products into a WooCommerce website. And it's uh, just a quick and easy tutorial. Uh, you have to use this import WooCommerce.com plugin. And uh, I'll show you step by step how you can use this plugin. And previously there were some errors in the uh, get data page, which we fixed in get Amazon new data page here and I'll show you the process of this new page. So first of all, uh, let's decide which product you want to import and the uh, browser you will be using is Google Chrome. So this is Google Chrome browser right now because we will need a Google Chrome extension as well. So first of all, uh, let's go to import WooCommerce.com and get this plugin. So if when you click this, get the plugin, it will redirect you to the wordpress.org website and download this plugin. We just updated it la last night and it's now uh, working fine. So once you download it and add it to your website, then come back to import WooCommerce.com again. And go to my profile. Of course, it will require a login. So now uh, just log into your website. So suppose this is your website and I'm using this as a dummy website so I can add products from uh, this tool. If we go to the shop page, you can see there are almost 1500, uh, 1600 products already added. And let me log in to my WP admin. Okay, on the dashboard, Let's go to the product section and you will see all the listed products, your existing products. Now go to plugins, click on add new and upload the plugin, which we downloaded from uh, wordpress.org or just type here, Amazon to WooCommerce, press enter. and scroll down to that Eagle logo and it's already added. Install this and activate this plugin. Once you activate this plugin in, on your website, you will see this menu, Amazon setting. Go to the Amazon settings page and copy this key. Okay. There are a couple of more settings. For example, if you are adding affiliate products, then use this one. Or if you want to sell products or drop ship the products, then this option will be used. So I'm currently using affiliate products, which, uh, which will have the Amazon's links with my affiliate tag ID. And this is my affiliate tag ID. So I add it here. And this is the margin. Uh, normally in affiliate products, we do not add any margins. So just remove that and click on save and copy this API key. Okay, copy this site key. Now go to import WooCommerce.com and you will have to log in here. Just log in or click on join now if you are new. There we have a free trial. Select that free trial. and fill up your form and click on submit and continue and it will allow you to log in to this website. Uh, let me skip this step and just log in here because I already have my username and password. Okay, I'm logged in here. Just click on this side to come to the front end again. Go to my profile page and paste that key 
uh, which we just copied from here paste it here and click on save and your website will automatically be connected like this shop.selfstudyhelp.com which is my website here okay once your website is connected go to get data and click on get amazon data new page because the old one is not working for approximately 70 percent of people because that is a huge number and php is stop responding to uh, amazon is stop responding to php that is why that option is not working for most of the people now so we have uh, we have created this new option and here is what it looks like okay now after uh, signing up and connecting your website you will have a chrome extension uh, here is the link right click and open a new tab and as i mentioned earlier you will have uh, you need to have this chrome browser to use this tool so th there it will be a add to chrome button just click on that and it will be appeared like this so close this now we have uh, extension added we have signed up here we have copied the um, API key from here and connected to our site in my profile. And now uh, we are on the get Amazon new data page. Okay. Now the part that uh, pro which products you want to import to your website. It's now connected. This tool is connected to the website. Now go to Amazon directly and search for the product which you want to add to your website. For example, uh, I am adding uh, toddler toys or Elsa doll or uh, just like that uh, DJI propellers for mini 3 and here is the result uh, we can copy this URL but let me add some extra filters like uh, I will just want to add 4 star and up because there are some 2 star products as well 2 star no star no star four star so i'll add this four stars and up and all the four stars and up products will be listed here and only dji brand should be here so let's choose brand if yeah only dji brand should be here and now we have about 31 products uh, 24 of which are on the same page so just copy this page and go to get data get amazon data page and scroll down here add this amazon url and click on get sitemap there it will generate a json array right click here and copy all the array now right click anywhere on the page and click on inspect element if this uh, inspect element shows up in the bottom then that's okay but if not then uh, for the first time it shows something like this when you right click an inspect element it shows something like this so click on these three dots not these ones these ones for the inspect element and click on dock to bottom and there you will see this web scrapper tab so go to web scrapper tab click on create sitemap import paste that json here and add a name like amazon propellers and click on import sitemap just like that click on sitemap and scrap and click on start strapping and wait for it i will not skip this part because uh, there are only 24 products and it will uh, go from 1 to 24 one by one and it will save the data into a csv format which will obviously uh, need some formatting but you don't have to worry about that because this tool will allow you to import products directly from that unformatted, not formatted CSV and add to your website. So we have uh, two products till now. We have three. It will get all the data, for example, the high quality images, the titles. You do not have to touch anything. You do not have to click anywhere. You do not have to close this browser until and unless it will complete automatically and it will, cl it will be closed. Then after that, we will get that CSV and import it to the website. That's the last step. So uh, it will get the reviews as well. Uh, for example, the price, short description, images, and title from here. The um, SKU will be got from here. And if you scroll down, we have 
reviews at the bottom customer reviews okay no reviews for this product so let's skip that like these reviews so it will automatically add these reviews to the product which you are importing in your WooCommerce store as well so let's complete this and we will get to move to the next step Okay, once this browser is closed automatically, just click on sitemap Amazon propellers again and click on export data, download CSV and save it anywhere like on desktop Amazon propeller.csv and save it. Now do not touch anything and close this inspect element as well and scroll to the top. Now here is the best part. You just have to uh, click on choose file and from desktop just go to desktop Amazon propellers and click on fetch and wait for the products to be loaded uh, so you can choose which products you want to add and which to be skipped now here is the best part you can see some of them have prices some of them have not added the prices some of them uh, have images you can see all of them are almost having images you can skip those which do not have image or price so let me remove this one this one this one and the ones that do not have prices added it's your choice if you want to add without price because there are some products which are uh, maybe not disclosed price or maybe out of stock and you still want to add them then you can uh, choose them as well now just click on start import and wait for it it will start importing by moving this number from 0 to uh, whatever is the total number of the products and it's approximately maybe okay 15 15 products will be added automatically to your website now if we come to our website and go to product section there were uh, approximately 1590 products and now there must be some numbers added okay four products already added let's wait for it one product search again okay there are some products added but uh, images are still not coming which will take some time you can see the titles images uh, SKUs prices the categories they are already added here I'll show you more options uh, once this progress is done okay there the images are already added to 1608 products which means we have approximately 12 products already added here but let's see uh, once this second number is completed and this is the total amount of time uh, is taking for these products to be added if you do them manually that will be a lot of work okay so 15 to 15 products added let's refresh it again and we have 1608 products some of them are duplicated and that is why not uh, added here but uh, other are added okay now just view the product we have the title we have the high quality images you can see it's very uh, high quality coming from Amazon uh, we have the description short description we have price 
we have the buy now product um, link which will have my affiliate tag as well we have the category we have the SKU and if you come to additional option we have the manufacturer we have the SN number as well so but the best part is if you go to reviews we have reviews as well this product have only one review let's see another one This one have eight reviews and the date is also important for, uh, for the reviews to be to, uh, which was added in Amazon that date will also be taken here so it will be very legit and I think that's all for today's video uh, I hope you learned uh, how to use this new tool and uh, this is this is all the all the best I could do for this video uh, if you have any questions then uh, I have this um, messenger connected to the website you can directly click start chat here and send me a message uh, it will take me about a day to respond uh, because I'm not always available there but I'll uh, definitely um, need, want to solve your problems if you have any so uh, please give this video a thumbs up and please subscribe to my channel and you will not miss my future videos. Thank you.